A couple of days ago, Gino dropped a comment on one of my videos. He was trying to take a song from the music app on his Mac and add it to an important photo slideshow. However, whenever he tried to add the song, he got a weird message about the audio track not being supported. So we exchanged a few more comments and decided to jump into Instagram so he could give me more information about his specific problem. Let's jump to the Mac so that I can show you what we discovered. So I'm already in the Photos app and I've already clicked the music note to find the song that I'd like to add. And when I click to add that song, I get the error message that Gino was getting. The selected audio track is not supported. DRM protected audio cannot be used in slideshows. So it turns out that Gino subscribes to Apple Music, which is Apple's streaming service and gives him access to millions of songs for one flat monthly fee. I subscribe to it too. The great thing about Apple Music is that you don't have to buy all of those tracks. You just pay one flat fee and you can play whatever you want, which is great. The key to Apple Music is that all of those songs are copy protected. As soon as you stop paying for the service, Apple will turn off your access to those files. How do they do that? Digital Rights Management or DRM. So Gino knew that he wanted to use this specific song. He just didn't want to use the DRM version of it. So he decided to go and buy it from the music app. Let's go check that out. This is the Bruno Mars song. This is not the song he wanted to use. I'm just using this as an example. So that's what I like. I like that song. Here we are. That's what I like. You'll notice that I have options to buy some of these other songs, but I don't have the option to buy That's What I Like. If I didn't know better, this would lead me to believe that I purchased this track, but I know that when I try to add it in my Photos app, I get that weird error message. The copy that it's trying to add is DRM protected, which is a clue that tells us this song is probably from Apple Music and it's probably not one that I purchased. So what can I do? Click on Apple Music, search for this song, here it is, and remove the download from my computer. It's still in Apple Music, but now I'm gonna go back to the iTunes store. The option to buy that song is available to me now. So I'm gonna purchase this song, and now I get the play button again. Notice the play button here after I purchase it looks just like the play button I have if I've downloaded it from Apple Music. Let's go back into the Photos app, and then we're gonna click Music, we'll expand, we'll search, that's what I like. Notice these other ones are grayed out, but this one is not. So the key here is if you try and add a song from the music app into your photo slideshow and you get that weird error message, it's probably the case that you have an Apple Music streaming version of the song downloaded to your device. Remove it from your library, then go back into the iTunes store, purchase the track to get the DRM-free copy. Got any questions? Drop a comment. See you in the next one.